Hello. In this video, we're gonna disassemble this uh, Lenovo laptop. The model is uh, T420. Let's start, of course, we'll take out the battery first. Now we have to remove all the screws on the back. <clears throat> I don't usually open uh, this type of laptops on a daily basis, so we'll see how it goes. We're gonna take out the hard drive. We're gonna open the the cover here for the memory because I think there's a screws underneath. Yeah, we have one here. <clears throat> we'll disconnect this card. Now we have to take out all the screws on the back <clears throat> and we'll see after that. Some of the screws are different light as you can see this one is much longer than the other so keep that in mind we have one screw here under the battery You can separate the screws if you think it's more complicated. Those two are shorter than the others. Now let's check. We'll take out the optical drive like this. <clears throat> this shouldn't be here, but we'll see. Now we're going to open the laptop. just a second sorry about that <clears throat> now we have to remove the keyboard we have to slide it a little bit up front and just lift it be careful with the cable like this i don't think this uh, has been opened before Let's remove this cover here and see can we clean it without removing this plate, but no. Okay. Now we have two screws here on the touchpad. Let's hope we only have to remove them. Otherwise the things are getting much complicated. Let's try to open it. Now, be careful because here should be a touchpad cable, yeah. Just lift it like this and the, the plastic is out. <coughs> now we'll just remove the speaker here in order to make a space 
for the color to come off. Let's see now. We'll unscrew the CPU screws here. <coughs> Let's try and lift. Yeah, we have to. We have the cables here. Sorry about that. We have to open them. Like this. And now we just have to remove it. We're going to use a smaller screwdriver in order to remove the screws here. So we can open and we have an access to the fan. Like this. We have a aluminium foil here, which we have to remove in order to separate them. You can remove it and after that put some uh, black tape. I'll try to reuse it if I can. Actually, the fun is pretty much like new inside. Uh, if you like, you can separate it, clean the, the bearing inside, use some, um, some oil to lubricate the fan, but this one is spinning pretty nice. Just in case I'm gonna put some oil on it. I am using a uh, oil for uh, sewing machines. Just put a little bit here on the axle and put it inside again. It rotates nicely. So We want to put the screws. And we're going to put the foil back. Like this. Now we're gonna use some paper and a Q-tip. Usually, when I clean the when I clean the CPU, I always use a dry Q-tip. This way, the old paste stucks very good on on it, and you don't make a lot of mess around it. like this after that just put some alcohol on the paper and clean the rest of the cpu like this and we want to clean the other half of the cooler like this Let me put some new paste on it.
I am using Arctic MX4. Pretty good for the price. Now let's slide this back again. the screws as much as you can now we're gonna connect the fan don't forget about it otherwise you have to open the laptop again now we're gonna put back the cables in the same order first the cables for the antenna and then the display cable I'm gonna put the speaker. like this place the cable <clears throat> now all we have to do is connect this cable after that slide Slide the plastic like this and put the two screws here. We have clips here that didn't fit. Yeah, now it's better. Now we have to come on, focus. Now I have to connect the keyboard back. Just push it. You should hear a clicking sound. Like this. Push the keyboard up front and then push it a little bit back. And that's the whole thing. Now we have to put the screws back which is the worst part the white one was here the two long ones 
or here, I think. Now this probably this was broken. I think we can go without it. Let's see. Yeah, the seed is okay. It's not a big deal. This is a Now these two long ones are here under the hinges. The short one was under the battery. These two are under the hinges also. Let's put back the memory cover and only these two here left. I think one is here and the other one is here. Let's put the hard drive. It's backwards, sorry. Back the battery and let's see do we have a picture yeah the laptop is coming on I have to clean it a little bit because it's very dusty they use it in uh, car garage for a car repair you can see, you see the flickering but this is uh, from my light so the refresh rate is different from this, the, the camera one so actually the, the display is fine basically that's the whole procedure uh, the video went longer but this is for now bye bye